What's the best business credit card for high volume? I'm an Amex dude, bro. So if you're running ads and shit, that uh, Amex Gold on the business side, it's, it's fire. Um, but anything Amex, man, you can get qualified. But Chase got some good cards. Um, City Bank, like all banks have some, have some decent cards. Dude, how long did it take for you to graduate? Six months. Yeah. So usually it's six months. But for me, when I get a new card, let's say I got a $1,000 limit. My limits are way higher than that, but. It's a thousand dollar limit, right? You want to use the credit card. Well, one of the problems are is that people don't um, use their credit card, right? So you get a thousand dollar limit, you use ten dollars of it each month. I think you ask for a credit limit increase, and they, they give you five hundred bucks, and you're upset. Well, look at it from the lender's point of view, right? A lot of stuff will start to make sense if you look at it from their point of view. Okay, a lender gave you a thousand, right? Credit card. You come back to them six months later. And I looked at, at the activity, you've only spent $100 within that six months. Why would I give you more credit? You don't need it. You know what I'm saying? But if you, that same scenario, you went back and you used 900 of it, you paid it off before the statement date, boom, 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 you being responsible with it. You go back, ask for a credit limit increase. They're going to say, okay, damn, 900, 980, 970, paid it off good, no late payments. All right, let's give them five thousand. Let's give them a four thousand dollar increase. So now it went from a thousand to five thousand. And then you just rinse and repeat every six months. Can you freeze your social on these things like check system prior to removing all that? Yeah. So, so here's the thing. So check systems and early warnings, they're a little bit different than LexisNexis and Clarity Services and ARS because LexisNexis, you can freeze, you can opt out of your information being shared. Check systems and early warnings is not like that. So for those ones, if you want to dispute something on there, you have to get the report and dispute it. You know what I'm saying? So it's a little bit different. You can still opt out too, but it's not the same opt out as like LexisNexis.